start to use foam and I see it's working and people like it and people uh, come and uh, they everybody it's not enough to look everybody won't come and Dutch. A Manitoba truck driver turned artist is taking his unique 3D author's technique to exhibits across the world with a new showcase called The World in Structure now taking center stage right here at Steinbach's Art Council. Growing up in Kiev, Ukraine, Eugene Kabrum's passion for art began at a young age. All my life I know I can draw, I can make some paintings uh, in school. Every time I make some paintings, and uh, but it's not was professional. Kabroom says while he grew older, he became more dedicated to his craft, even taking lessons in Kiev and taking part in children's art shows until he moved to Canada in 2007 to become a truck driver, which he worked as until 2017 before making a big change. Sell my truck and uh, uh, you know clean my head and uh, I think about uh, painting and um, I start to use uh, foam. And this 3D author's technique started to catch the attention of art galleries around the world, including the United States, Israel, Canada, Russia and more, with the newest showcase called The World in Structure at the Steinbach Arts Council, which Kabroom says has a special place in his heart as they were the first gallery to give his work a chance. They uh, call me and come, said come, I come and uh, bring a couple my painting. And I think in 2018, it was my first uh, exhibition. Now, six years later, executive director at Steinbach Arts Council, David Clausen, says it was a no-brainer to once again display Eugene's art. One of the reasons why we love Eugene is he has a unique style. He has a unique ability to build texture into these pieces and to bring them off the canvas a little bit more. And these stunning pieces aren't just for looking or, as Eugene says, touching. The Steinbach Arts Council lets you take them home. We've sold a couple of his pieces already. This is something that we do for the artists. We let them display their work in our center and we help them promote their own artwork and to bring it to the public. And Kabroom says he couldn't do this alone, as while he loves to paint, the market side of everything he leaves to his son Dan. My dad needed help to get you know paintings around galleries um, so I started emailing so I could translate for him um, and we actually got into galleries and wow like we're, we're, we're having paintings not only in like Winnipeg but also now we're having it in the, in the states we're having it like abroad um, it was a really cool experience yeah. And while Eugene is back driving trucks he says his love for art will never fade and hopes one day his passion project will turn into a full-time job. In Winnipeg, Mitchell Ringo, City News.